Lads, save your singing for Davy Jones and Jagabats. It's a hard wind coming. The man speaks true. You lot weigh anger. As for the rest, half on the foremast and half at the main. Let's outrun this hurricane. Keep watch on those galleons. See, they don't give us trouble. They will. Far too slow for this weather. Get up there, sir. I don't like them, mate. Ah! They're on their bow line. Hey! Mark any orders you think wise, mate. We're up against it here. These men know their place. They'll see us home. Weakest right there, come in! Fire! Ready to fire, sir! Fire! Have a shot! Fire! Right there, sir! Down! 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 Every last scrap of duck on the wind! What 
Another spot, man! Stay away! It's not looking good. Steady as she goes, man! Rip the yards off the wind! Muzzle your top! Loose all! Rip the yards off the wind! By God, we pulled this one straight from the teeth of Neptune. I'm Edward. Much thanks for your aid back there. Adewale. Ever been to Nassau, Adewale? Not yet. By God, she took some knocks, didn't she? I think I'll keep her. All hands aft, lads! We're taking this one home! I've made my choice, Addy. I'm calling her the Jackdaw. A sly bird I loved as a child back in Swansea. A dark little creature, no? Did it rub you wrong when I took this brig as mine own? <laughs> it was the sort of rub I have learned to endure, sailing among faces of such... fairness. It's true. Most of these men wouldn't accept you as a captain. So what fair role would complement such unfairness? I'll be your quartermaster. Nothing less. All right. And as quartermaster, have you any immediate counsel for this Tyro captain? Rest and repast would do us good before Nassau. Water for drinking. Hunting for food and repairs. Well reasoned, sir. Hunting, that shall be. We'll find a decent place to drop anchor. I spied a few items in the hold earlier. Powder and a few pistols. I think I'll fashion a second holster if I can. <laughs> it's a good start. One you find laughable. Could we talk a moment about the condition of the ship? What's the trouble? I had a walk about the gun deck this morning and couldn't stand for what I saw. A clutter of linen stocks heaped like tinder and one with a slow match still burning. Christ. And just nearby, two barrels of gunpowder 
closer than man and wife. Fit to explode at the touch of a spark. We'll stow ours good and proper. As for the cannons, they might as well be tossed. Clogs touch holes in need of scraping, corrosion on the bodies, barrel swabs as naked as knives, and breech ropes so rotted, I could use them for knitting yarn. The short of it is, we need good equipment kept in fine condition. But we cannot win every battle with snares and shouts. So worry about your own armament when it suits you. But don't forget about your jackdaw as well. No, indeed. We'll make it a point to keep this ship and its crew in fine condition. Swim us off the wind! Ahoy, Lord! Bring it all in! <laughs> 